This is the off season for farmers in northeastern and central Pennsylvania, but that doesn't mean they are not busy. In this week's Check It Out, Newswatch 16's Chelsea Strube checks out a maple farmer in Lackawanna County. It's been a very busy off season for Dennis Burke in his woods up here in Fells Township. <laughs> This is actually, uh, everything from this lineup is new this year. Which brings the total amount of tubing here on his maple farm to stretch as far as 20 miles. A not so small, small business here in Lackawanna County. Next month, it will be tapping time on these trees. Right now, it's all about maintenance of this wet, dry collection system. What it does is actually lowers the pressure inside the tubing, like a, a science vacuum and that allows the tree to push the sap into the tubing. Dennis says before spring, when the nights are below freezing and the days are above freezing, the tree itself will work like a pump as it sends nutrients or sap up to the treetops to begin the budding process. His taps will collect a portion of the sap and send it through this network okay. of tubing. So you drop, in, you drop into a tree and then it gets hooked onto a lateral line and then it branches down into the trunk line that goes miles all the way down to the farm. Well in this case just over a half a mile yeah. Wow. You got it. All the way down to his evaporator to eventually make maple syrup. Right now Dennis is fighting with one of his nemesis here in the woods. We're just fixing a little little deer damage. They uh, for some reason they like to come in and chew on the tubing. I'm not sure what interests them in it. This is actually brand new tubing I ran uh, in July. So it can't be the sap or sugar content in it. Deer and fallen trees. Making for a lot of work in the off season. That's messy right now because of the warmer temperatures. Dennis would prefer a frozen ground or a little snow. But adding support lines and boosters will help keep things here more secure. So come tapping time, everything's good to go. Dennis has an open door policy, so if you drive by and see smoke coming from his evaporator, you're welcome to pop in and check out how this all works. Chelsea Strube, Newswatch 16, Lackawanna County.